Hi there everyone, this is Tracy from Lavinia Stamps. Thank you for joining me again today for another demonstration. Um, we're going to be using some of our Colourburst collection papers. They're 150 GSM, double sided, there's 30 sheets there and 10 unique colours. So we've got some fabulous backgrounds ready to stamp straight onto something quick and easy if you need to make a quick card or if you just don't want to create the backgrounds yourself this is just a um, an easy solution so we're going to be using inking up one of our fairies um, and just creating a scene on this lovely card so I'm just going to ink her up this is in the VersaFine Nocturne make sure that she's completely covered silhouettes and um, they're always a bit tricky so just check in the light make sure that that's covered and then you're ready to go okay so I'm just going to pop her down around about the middle just let that rest a while let the ink soak into the card okay so we've got a little bit here it's just not quite come out <clears throat> so but don't worry about that I'm just going to ink up the very edge of my smoothie and just colour that in And that's all it takes so okay so I'm going to use um, a little bit of acetate now that I cut out pop that over the top and then using a smoothie I'm going to go around the edge using warm breeze so just gently go around the edge And there we go okay so we want a little bit of foliage and maybe some words to go around the edge as well so I've got some fairy lanterns here so I'm going to ink those up this is in the warm breeze again and I'm just going to bob those around the top here and then using the nocturne some over the top like so and then we need something down here just to balance that out so taking one of our trees
we're just about get that on there. And I'm going to ink up in the Nocturne. And just bob a couple of those about at the bottom and I'll do one in the warm breeze as well. Okay, so I'm going to go around the edge of the card now. Um, pick a different colour I think this time maybe go with a more medieval blue which is quite a sort of purple colour and just work our way around the edge This completely changes how it looks just by adding this border. Okay. So I'm using our fairy words now and I'll go back to the medieval blue and just ink up and just pop a few words around. have it so I will go around the edge of the moon with my glue pen And then I'm just going to add a few dots over these lanterns and down the card. Okay. So I'm going to use the blue and purple glitter and I'm just going to sprinkle that over the top now. And simply tap off and there we have a really nice example of what you can do with these background papers. And it's so quick and easy. Well, I hope that you enjoyed that um, and it's inspired you to have a go yourselves. So thanks for joining me again today. Take care, guys. Bye for now.